As some of you might already know, the Albion Online devs have added to the test server almost everything that's coming in the next big update. You know what that means! We're checking out the new maps today, boy! We're checking out the new maps and I'm really excited about that. Before we start, I gotta let you know about something. Those were my absolute first impressions. I've never seen any of those maps before recording it right now. Oh boy! <laughs> I'm just letting you know prior to seeing all of this, you will see how easily distracted I am. This is a tier 5 desert area. Here's how it looks. This is a desert. But also a tropical island in a way. I don't know how to describe it. Man, this is so cool. Like, look at this. This is... This was such a well-needed update. This is a tier 6 desert area. And here's how everything looks. Man, I'm enjoying this so much. Yo, look what I found. Look what I found. Look what I found. Um, I don't think I'll be able to do it, though. I should have taken a sustain build. Why didn't I take a sustain build, man? Yeah, this is not gonna work. Oh, I should have taken a sustain build, man. I would have gotten a mammoth right here. Come on, man. This would have been a mammoth. Oh, this is so sad. I mean, it's a test server. It wouldn't be very useful here. But still. Oh, what is that? Energy Vortex. What is that thing? What? Oh, is it going to move every single time I'm... Oh, I, I mean, it's good because it uh, attracts your attention. What is that? Will I die? This is a tier 7 desert map. And it looks like this. Bro. Just look at this. This, this has the vibe of a tropical island. Like, it doesn't necessarily feel like a desert. It feels like a haven in uh, in one of the deserts. You know, like when you when you go into a desert and you're thirsty and you're almost dying and you find a, a safe haven with water and all that good stuff. This is so nice. This has a weird Wild West vibe to it, doesn't it? Like, for real. It doesn't feel dead. Like, it doesn't feel necessarily like a desert. It feels more like an abandoned area. I don't know how to describe it. More like a savanna, I would say. But this is cool. This is very cool. Let me see. Run in, Mog. Run in. That, that was always a good idea so far. Come on. Come on! No! That's gonna do a lot of damage! This is properly hard, man! This is properly hard! Oh! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Uh, poison over there! Yes! Thank you! <gasps> okay, the guy died! Perfect, 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 perfect! Oh, that was a bad play! That was a bad play. This is genuinely hard, man. So how much fame do you give? Let me kill this thing fast. This is a tier 5 forest area. I like this, man. This is, I think, the chillest forest. It kind of shifts onto a mountain in a way. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong, but it kind of feels... Like that kind of forest that would end up uh, like on a mountain. Like you just go up and up and up and up and up. And this is the last part of the forest. Or the first part. I cannot tell. But it's good either way. I like this. I like this a lot, man. And the mobs, man. Everything is so much fun. This is nice. This is just nice. This is a tier 6 forest. 
bro. <laughs> so nice. Like, I'm impressed at everything right now. This is... You know what this reminds me of? If you played World of Warcraft, uh, you know there was, uh, like in Legion, they added an area in which druids can go in, can teleport in. I don't remember how it was called, but it was like a portal area. That. That is what this is. And it, it looks so good. Man. This is so nice. Like, for real, I like everything they did. I like absolutely everything they did. I like the mobs and how they look. I like... I like the music and how it changes. I like the fact that you can... Let, let me see. Let me see. Will we find something good here? Yeah, no. Those are the resources, Mark. Alright. So, so they're not aspects as I've thought. This is a tier 7 forest area. And it's by far my favorite thing. This is so good. Like, are you kidding me? This is so good. No, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go explore here. No way I'm not exploring here. Bro. You know what I've said about the tier 6 area? In regards to the fact that it kind of looks like the Legion World of Warcraft area that uh, druids have access to? No, this is that. Oh, and there's another one of those tornadoes over there. That is cool, man. That is cool. This is a tier 8 forest area. I don't know why, but this reminds me of Robin Hood. Doesn't it? Like, in a weird way? I don't... I would love to play a ranger in those forests. Like, imagine you just own this territory... You are all rangers, skinners, as a crafting, a gathering profession, I mean. You all craft bows, you hunt, and you just keep this area safe. Man, that, that is so cool. That, that is some really nice roleplay ability the devs just added right here. I didn't pay attention to the silver up until this moment. Let me see. Do you actually get that much silver? Alright. That was the fame for the bear. Oh, that was a hard hitting ability. A very hard hitting ability. Can I kill this guy? I think I can. I think I can. I'm pretty sure I can. Yes. Alright. Let's see the silver. Yo, this is taking much longer than I've expected. So I think that the best choice would be to spread this in two videos. You guys know me, I'd much rather have short and packed with content videos. So next part is coming tomorrow or the day after tomorrow, stay tuned for that. If you want me to check out anything the new update has, please leave your suggestions down in the comment section down below and I'll make sure to look at everything. Thank you so much y'all for watching, see you tomorrow!